Wale Wale. We are in the upper east of the north. Northeast. The northeast, okay. And so we're going to go and see yeah, the yeah, chief. We're in Sayu precisely. Where? Sayu. Sayu. It's called Sayu. This is this village is called Sayu precisely. Mm. And so we're going to see the chief because before we do anything, it's important to say hello, let them know our mission, what I'm coming to do here. And of course, what I'm coming to do is good news, right? Doing some women empowerment. So let's see what he has to say. So we just spent some time with the chief. We greeted them. They were a bit quiet, but I guess we let them know what we were coming to do. So that's good. But interesting fact, I found out that their huts are really low, so that by force you have to greet to enter, to show respect. I bet you didn't know that. In the comment section, if you feel like you knew or you didn't know, then let me know. Now I'm about to get my hands or nails dirty. <laughs> are done together. If there is an activity one person will go around letting the ladies know that on this particular day they'll need help with etc and the next day everybody arrives in their group. to look pretty okay we're gonna get that work done okay guys let's go we're about to start building the way that they do in the culture <laughs> it's actually quite heavy guys Nobody is paid in this community as it is a communal activity but when it is done like that the drummers are also called to get involved. The drummers begin at dawn and that is the alarm to let everybody know that the activity has started. Tell us what are we doing here today? Okay so what we're going to experience today here is uh, the ancient and local way that the pure modern wow. you know go about this their way of life in terms of flooring mm -hmm. you know a home. So they floor their homes themselves? Yes, they do that. Wow. So when we had no expert knowledge of masonry uh, the use of uh, shovel and towels and stuff like that our ancient and mothers uh, had an activity called Zige. Ziggy. Yeah, this is called Ziggy. Okay. Yeah, so they, they'll be joining the woman 
to see how the zige is done. So the zige is only done by ladies? It's done by ladies. Only? So the men build and then the ladies... The ladies do the flooring. Exactly. You know, we lay the foundation, you know. We lay the foundation. Okay, so this is how they do in the north. I'm excited. Yep. Let's go. Okay. So firstly, what is this that they're using, Sam? Yeah, so uh, they are using the gravel. Okay. You can see it's, it's gravel. They use the gravel. Mix it with, uh, they will add cement to it. But at the moment, what they want to do is uh, they would make sure that they spread the gravel to get an even, uh, very flat floor. Then they would then be sprinkling water whilst heating with what they, the tool called sampani, sampani, which is made from a wood. Okay. Yes, yeah, so you'll be seeing that later on. Right, yes, so cool. it's made from wood. And the purpose of heating is to make sure that they compact the gravel mm -hmm. well on this ground on so that it doesn't you know, spoil easily. So, yeah, yes, Oma. This one year number one. Over China, not in your two one chance in Cabo Yati, over to our own home. So, they will come to the same. Hey, they are giving your husband. The work is extremely tiring, but these ladies do not get tired because they are used to the job. As they work, they bring their children along, so when they get older, their children are able to take over. This is a type of job that is done and passed down from generation to generation. Thankfully, the introduction of tricycles have made this work easy for the ladies to carry water and cement. But before, they would have had to do all of this themselves. I'm sweating already, guys. We had to take a pause because if the sand starts sticking to this, what's this called again? Sampani. If it starts sticking to the sampani, it means they need to add more sand. And I've only done five minutes, and look at my hands. Eesh. I need to work out, but this time I'll get muscles from after this. Look at the sweat. <laughs> Now we're currently waiting for the cement to dry before a stone is used to smoothen the floor. If the weather was better, then the cement would have dried much quicker.
comes to the songs, traditionally, there is a special medicine given to an individual. And when you drink that medicine, you become a singer naturally. And so when you are doing an activity, the songs just flow naturally. Contains uh, motivative, uh, 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 what do you call lyrics? Okay. Uh -huh. So, uh, what do you call it? The, 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 yeah. So the the, the one is the one is saying that the one is telling them that this is what do you call it? Uh, 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 a group of women uh -huh. energizing themselves to please their, their husbands. Hey. Oh, they should, they should. How to please the husband? Oh, then I should have gone harder. <laughs> hey, husband, if you are watching, watch the way I'm. And you can also see that what they did here is to make sure that they compact the gravel world on the ground. Guys, I can feel a blister coming. I can feel a blister coming. But it's all worth it. This shows you the hard work that these ladies do. Your hands are so important, guys. When you wake up every single day, thank God that you have working hands, ten fingers and ten toes. Because, yo, this is not for the faint hearted. Sometimes a previous singer can teach another person how to sing, but it's mainly only special people that are allowed to sing. This way of masonry is very economical, as river sand is not needed as it would if a professional mason was working on it. It takes less cement and only gravel and sand is used with minimal cement on top to create this floor. The name of this activity is called Ziggy. Watching these ladies and how they were able to come together with all their different ages and sizes was so inspiring. Watching how together they came together 
and use themselves to entertain themselves and motivate each other was more than a sight to see, an experience I'd never forget. So now what they are doing is uh, to make sure that they spread the cement mm -hmm. uh, to cover all the portion that you took, I mean you did the activity. How long will it take to dry or to... So they, so they are saying that it's because we didn't start early. If not that, uh, by now, it should have been dry. And once it gets dry, uh, they will then use the, the, what do you call it, that stone that I told you. Uh -huh, to make it more smoother. Okay. Yes. So at the moment, what they are just doing is to ensure that all the portions that uh, you guys worked on, uh, is, uh, the, the cement is applied. And it'll be looking nice and brand new tomorrow. Uh, exactly. Lovely. Yeah. 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 Now, one thing that I need to also add is that this is very economical mm -hmm. because you, this, you don't need river sand. If you are going to use the masonry, you need river sand. Uh, you need you know a lot of cement, but this takes lesser cement and also it is just gravel and sand. Gravel, sand and yes. a little bit of cement on the top. Exactly, which water. Oh, wow. That's it. Oh. Listen, everything that we need in this world is provided by God. Seriously. So she's telling you that if you go home tonight, I'm gonna you will actually feel what you did. I will feel, I can see, I've done a workout guys, I'm trying to lose weight, so they're doing it. Ah. <laughs> That was my, this is what we call a ziggy ziggy. <laughs> ziggy ziggy? Ziggy. 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 I have done it today. Listen, I have worked out with the ladies. I have cemented a floor. Grandma, let me see your muscles. Let me see. I'm going to be strong as grandma one day. See you guys. <laughs>